Hey guys, of course, of ours, 2018 here, and and then today I'm gonna show you how to make anemometers. So, first, go to your spawn list, and then go to S props, and then go to plates, and then oh crap, okay, yeah. All right, so <clears throat> go to the bottom right here. I know, it, I know it feel weird by talking but I'm, I'm my voice is changing right now I'm sorry about that okay so this is the uh, this is the part of the anemometer so I'll talk about that later uh, it's supposed to be like that yeah that's the, yeah that's the one okay this is the part of the anemometer and all that stuff and then I'm gonna go to triangles because I like to use triangles for part of the wing. All right, now all you need to do first, you have to. Okay, now go to X's right here, and then click it right here, and then. And then click it right here. You have to left click on the prop and then left click it, and then it'll like. All right, now this is the this is the part of the spinning one. And this is, you know what? Everything's going to be stable collisions. So I know that's uh, okay. So. It looks a little bit weird, so I'm gonna fix that. Sorry about that. So. Alright, there you go, now it's fixed. Well, you know what? Let's just leave it alone. Okay, now. Go to this one. Part of the. Okay, first, you have to go to weight. If you get. Go get the weight from the workshop. And then go down to one. And then now you have to weld on the part of it. So well but first you have to use X's again. And then left click it again and then boom you just alright. Now This is the part of the wing here. Right, let's see. Okay, that's perfect. That's perfect. Okay, now you have to turn it around. Make it as a perfect spot as you want it to be. Well, I when I was like a little kid, I used to make anemometers. I tried once, and it, it was like very terrible. And I did it better right now. So, okay, that's terrible. So let's fix that. Okay, now you have to weld it. Okay, now the cool part is to go to this one, the debug white, and then do all of those, and then go to colors, and then go to black, and uh, change it to normal. Okay, so don't worry about that, and then boom. You have your first anemometer that you made. It actually looks pretty cool or not. I don't know. But it actually looks pretty cool as well. But now the cool part that you can like do whatever that you can just do it whatever you want. You can just get your random vehicles wherever you want it. 
and then you can just use this and put it right on the vehicle. Just like put it right on the vehicle. And you can like storm chase trails wherever you want to with your cool anemometer. So I hope you guys like this video. Make sure to leave a like, share, and subscribe. So I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.